Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. Today we're going to take a look at Francesco Bernoulli, the Italian World Grand Prix Racer number 1 from Cars 2. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, Francesco is a an Italian Ferrari 150 Italia Formula 1 car, my guess is. And he grew up watching races in his hometown of Monza, Italy, especially his mama, Mama Bernoulli, who I don't have, and is one of Lightning, one of the racing rivals of Lightning McQueen, and, and was voiced by John Turturro, who also played Sector 7 agent Seymour Simons in the Bayverse Transformers film series. In Cars 2, he was... He, along with Sir Miles Axelrod, were on TV being interviewed by Mel Dorado, who I don't have, have and Mater called in to the TV show oh, by saying that Lightning McQueen can that Lightning can beat him anytime he anytime anywhere and prefers to slow down every once in a while oh, much to the enjoyment of Francesco then Lightning called in then and saying by calling him, calling Francesco fragile, which which made, which set in Francesco off very easily. Although the fra although it does make sense, because Formula One cars are fragile, and the fragile, and I must admit that part was very funny. What do you guys? But what do you guys think? Was it actually funny of Lightning to call Francesco fragile? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. So, anyhow, when 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 Mater introduced Lightning to Francesco at the welcoming party in Tokyo, Japan. Mater told Francesco about uh, Sally and how she's a fr fan of Francesco, and then, and then, and after the toast for tomorrow, Francesco showed lightning his. Chow McQueen bumper sticker, which is also very funny. Was it actually funny? Leave that in the comments down below. So anyhow, during the, before the first race of the World Grand Prix, Lightning, when Lightning was preparing to race by saying his motto, Speed, I'm Speed, Francesco just laughed and, and used his own original motto, Triple speed, Francesco is triple speed. <laughs> Although I must admit, it was that the third time it was very funny. What do you guys think? Was it actually funny? Leave that in the comments down below. So anyhow, during the race, when it was time to hit the dirt, Francesco oh, lost a bit of momentum in the dirt, and Lightning was the first to take advantage by doing turn right to go left. And when the race and when the racers hit the asphalt again, Francesco, who was left in last place, began to build up momentum to make up for lost time. And at the final, and at the final lap, when Mater said go outside, right, lightning in, in moved and suddenly moved to the outside, causing Francesco to take the lead and win the race, much to the frustration of lightning. And and before and and before the second race of the World Grand Prix in Porto Corsa, Italy, 
Hmm? Lightning was feeling sad about missing his BFF Mater, and like Fran and Francesco said that he misses him, and as well as well as he misses his mama, Mama Brunun Newly, who was standing in the crowds. And then Francesco stated to her that he will be his crybaby bottom today. <laughs> Yet another funny part of Francesco. Was it actually funny? Leave that in the comments down below. So anyhow, during the at the final lap of the race, the two racing rivals were neck and neck to the finish line, and Lightning regained his winning streak, leaving Francesco in second. Then, when the ambulances were on the scene, they they saw a whole wreckage of of most of the racers on the screen. Hmm. Apart from Jeff Gorvet and Lewis Hamilton, who were able to apply the brakes to avoid the crash easily. Then, at, during the final race in London, England, while Francesco was still on the track, Lightning, Mater, Fimit Missile, and Holly Shiftwell zoomed past him and Francesco said, what is happening twice? and thought it was all a bad dream, which it, by the way, it wasn't. And before the final, the final official race, uno, the final uno, unofficial race of the World Grand Prix, or should I say the Radiator Springs Grand Prix, Lightning introduced Francesco to Sally, and Lightning showed him his Kachow Francesco bumper sticker, which was very funny, although I must admit. What do you guys think? Was it actually funny? Leave that in the comments down below. And Francesco said that he is fine looking by Flo. And during... And Francesco returned as one of the play as one of the the big main playable characters in the Cars 2 video game voiced by Turturro once again and when he and Lightning along with Mater Holly and Finn were at the Chrome Training Academy and Francesco stated that that they will see much better how high-speed chases are with o with the open wheel cars. And, and and in one and in one level, oh, Francesco told oh, Lightning and Carl Carla Veloso and a playable character, whether if it was Lightning McQueen or some other character that the player would choose, you know, Francesco stated that it was very thoughtful of them to race Francesco in his hometown. And that is completely it. And now, without any more further ado, let's get right into the review. Here we've got his friendly facial expression, his red exterior and his green and white interior and a number one and in the Italian flag insignia. And on the left side we've got the Rotilli tires which are partially faded and the and the Formula Racing logo and the All in All logo and the WGP number one and his name signature and on the spoiler, we've got the World Grand Prix logo. And on the back side, we've got the World Grand Prix logo, the Italian flag insignia, and the number one. And on the right side, similar design, but completely different. And 
Oh, and I forgot, almost forgot to mention one thing, that the underbase is white all over, so Francesco was released numerous of times, but in a, but with the black underbase. So, this is an inaccurate model. So hopefully I'll get the accurate version of Francesco himself. And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other, other Italian cars. We've got Uncle Topolino, Carlo Maserati, Michael Schumacher, and Luigi and Guido. And now let's pull up some of the pull up some of the other chrome the I mean the other World Grand Prix contenders. You've got Carlo Veloso, Miguel Camino, Nigel Gearsley, Max Schnell, Shu Todoroki, Lewis Hamilton, Jeff Gorvet, Rao Sorau, and of course his racing rival, Lightning McQueen. And now let's pull up some of the the other other more of Lightning McQueen's racing rivals, like Chick Hicks and Jackson Storm. And that is completely it. So what do you guys think? Which racing rival of Lightning McQueen is your favorite? Which Italian car is your favorite? And which World Grand Prix contender is your favorite also? Leave your thoughts and some suggestions of which car of the past should I review next in the comments down as well. And if you have enjoyed this video, Please make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos and consider the support by viewing my viewing more on my channel for public watch hours. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Oh, I forgot to mention one thing. And as I've always said in the previous World Grand Prix Racer videos, the only racer that I don't have in the World Grand Prix Racer collection is Rip Clutch Gonski. So anyhow, goodbye now!